ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರುಪರಂಪರಾ ಶ್ರುತಿ ಸ್ಮೃತಿ ಪುರಾಣ ಆಲಯ ಕರುಣಾಲಯ ನಮಿ ಭಗವತ್ಪಾದ ಶಂಕರ ಲೋಕಶಂಕರ ಶಂಕರ ಶಂಕರಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಕೇಶವ ಪಾದರಾಯಣ ಸೂತ್ರಭಾಷ್ಯಕೃತ ವಂದೇ ಭಗವಂತ ಪುನಃ ಪುನಃ ಈಶ್ವರೋ ಗುರುರಾತ್ಮೇತಿ ಮೂರ್ತಿಭೇದ ವಿಭಾಗಿನೇ ವ್ಯೋಮವ್ಯಾಪ್ತೇಹಾಯ ದಕ್ಷಿಣಾಮೂರ್ತ ಸಹ ನಾಮವತು ಸಹ ನೌಹನಕ್ತು ಸಹ ವೀರ್ಯಂಕರವಾಮಹೈ ತೇಜಸ್ವಿ ನಾವಧೀತಮಸ್ತು ಮಾವಿದ್ವಿಷಾವಹೈ ಓಂ ಶಾಂತಿ 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 ಧಾತು ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೈವ ಸಂಪ್ರೋಕ್ತ ಜೀವ ಆಖ್ಯಾತ ಮುಚ್ಯತೆ ಪ್ರಕೃತಿ ಕೃಸುವಂತಾದಿರ್ ಧಾತು ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಾತ್ಮನೇ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪರೋ ವ್ಯಕ್ತ ಧಂಧಮ ವ್ಯಕ್ತ ಸಂಭವ ಮಂಡಸ್ಯಾಂತಸ್ಮೇ ಲೋಕ ಸಪ್ತದ್ವೀಪಾಚನೆ so we were in the fourth chapter and looking at uh, shloka 22 it is the bar here this page you need to find the bar here to scroll down okay anyway so let's uh, we are here okay yeah so here in the last shloka we saw that the person who is satisfied with his uh, with samaha with siddhi and asiddhi who is happy with whatever he gets by prarabdha yadrcha labha santushta dvandvatita and who is who is balanced with all these dvandvas that present themselves as per the person's karma vimatsara siddhau asiddhau cha samaha and what is that he krutva api nadibadyate whatever he does whatever he does that karma does not bind him because he is no longer a karta and therefore he will no longer be a bhukta then we saw the i think we have seen the uh, introduction i don't know whether it is we seen the introduction in anyway, tyaktva karma phala sangam ityanena shlokena yah prarabdha karma san yada nishkriya brahmatma darshana sampanna ಸ್ಯಾತ್ ತದಾ ತಸ್ಯ ಆತ್ಮನ ಕರ್ತೃಕರ್ಮ ಪ್ರಯೋಜನಾಭಾವದರ್ಶಿನ ಕರ್ಮ ಪರಿತ್ಯಾಗೆ ಪ್ರಾಪ್ತೆ ಕುತಶ್ಚಿನ್ ನಿಮಿತ್ತ ತದ ಸಂಭವೇ ಸತಿ ಪೂರ್ವವತ್ತಸ್ಮಿನ್ ಕರ್ಮಣಿ ಅಭಿಪ್ರವೃತ್ತಿ ನೈವ ಕಿಂಚಿತ್ ಕರೋತಿ ಸಹ ಇತಿ ಕರ್ಮಾಭಾವ ಪ್ರದರ್ಶಿತ ಐಮ್ ನಾಟ್ ಶ್ಯೂರ್ ವೆದರ್ ವಿ ಹವ್ ಡನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಎನಿ ಒನ್ ಕನ್ಫರ್ಮ್ ವೆದರ್ ವಿ ಹವ್ ಡನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸೊ ಆಲ್ ಸಿ ಇಫ್ ಐ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಕ್ವಿಕ್ಲಿ ಗೋ ಥ್ರೂ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ ಶುಡ್ ಐ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೇನ್ ಈಚ್ ಐ ಡೋಂಟ್ ರಿಮೆಂಬರ್ ಐಮ್ ಸಾರಿ ಐ ಡೋಂಟ್ ರಿಮೆಂಬರ್ ವೆದರ್ ವಿ ಹವ್ ಡನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸಂಗತಿ we have that okay so yasya evam karma bhav darshitah tasya eva so tyaktva karma phala sangam having given up the association with karma and its and phala through this shloka in the 20th shloka what was known as one who is samarpita to prarabdha karma who follows prarabdha karma he does not oppose it oppose the circumstances he goes with the flow he does what is needed to be done but without you know opposing it yada nishkriya brahmatma darshana sampanna syat then when he attains nishkriya brahma nirguna brahma tada tasya atmana kartup karma prayojana bhav darshinah he sees no prayojana due to seeing absence of prayojana in any kartru or karma therefore what karma parityage prapte he should be taking to sanyasa but kutash chinnimita tada sambhave means he is unable to take to sanyasa sati saptami tada sambhave sati purva tasmin karmani abhipravrtasya even if he is doing for loka sangraha because he cannot take to sanyasa he has no adhikara in karma but he is doing it as a as though a karma yogi although being a jnani then not being a karta he cannot be a bhokta therefore naiva kinchit karoti so his karma is karma bhavah or what is also called as karma bhasah akarma eva ಇತಿ ಕರ್ಮಾಭಾವ ಪ್ರದರ್ಶಿತ ಸೊ ಸಚ್ ಕರ್ಮಾಭಾವ ಆರ್ ಕರ್ಮಾಭಾಸ ಆರ್ ಆಸ್ ಪರ್ ದಿ ಅದರ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಕರ್ಮ ಬಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಹಿಮ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಕರ್ಮ ದಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಬಿನ್ ಶೋನ್ ಎಂ ಕರ್ಮಾಭಾವ ದರ್ಶಿತ ದಸ್ಯವ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ಅ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಹೂ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಜ್ಞಾನಿ ಬಟ್ ಹೂ ಕೆನಾಟ್ ಲೀವ್ ದಿ ಕರ್ಮ ಫಾರ್ ವಾಟ್ ಎವರ್ ರೀಸನ್ಸ್ ವಿ ಸಾ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಪಾಠ ಗತ ಸಂಗಸ್ಯ ಮುಕ್ತ ಜ್ಞಾನಾವಸ್ಥಿತ ಚೇತಸ ಯಜ್ಞಾಚರ ತಕ್ಕರ್ಮ ಸಮಗ್ರಂ ಪ್ರವಿಲೀಯತೆ ಸೊ ಗತ ಸಂಗಸ್ಯ ಮುಕ್ತ ದಟ್ ಮುಕ್ತ who is a jeevan mukta and why he is gata sanga gata 
गत संग यूर्व बहुरी हो सो गत संग वन हू संग इज गॉन संग वॉज देर विथ दी बॉडी मैंड सेंस कॉम्प्लेक्स नाउ इट इज गॉन ड्यू टू ज्ञान हि इज नॉट एसोसिएटेड विथ दी बॉडी मैंड सेंस कॉम्प्लेक्स सो गता इज गॉन अवे संग गत संग यार गत गॉन अवे यस्मा ऑल्सो इज ओके पंचमी षष्टी और पंचमी भौरी मुक्त फॉर विच पर्सन द पर्सन हू इज मुक्त हू इज फ्री नाउ फ्री और फ्रीड बोथ वे यू कैन सी मुक्त इज वन हू इज फ्रीड बाय अदर्स देर बाय कर्मणी और वन हू इज फ्री बाय हिमसेल्फ कर्तरी ऑल्सो मुक्त गत संग से मुक्त ज्ञानवस्थित चेतस ज्ञानवस्थित चेत ज्ञान वॉट आर द वर्ड ज्ञान अवस्थित चेतस सो यर सी ज्ञान द वर्ड ज्ञान इज देर लुडंत एंड अवस्थित इज तांत चेतस इज न्यूटर and here you see in saman adikran shashti chetasai shashti so this is bahuri jnane jnane avasthita avasthitam because chetas is is neuter therefore jnane avasthitam cheto yasya jnane jnane saptami jnane avasthitam cheto cheta is mana chetah yasya That is the Bahuri here. Here, this was Bahuri, which was what one one six or five Bahuri. Okay. Tasse mukta sya jnana vasya cheta saha. Who jnane jnane in jnana whose mind is sthita avastita is sthita very well. He has nishta prapta now. Nishta is prapta for him. And then what? Why does he do karma? He does karma for loka sangra, as it been said in the earlier shloka. It is not karma for him. Then yajna ya acharya karma. Yajna we have seen earlier. This entire thing, the way the world goes around, is due to karma done as an offering unto the Lord. So that chakra is yajna chakra. Every karma is to be seen as yajna. So here yajna ya tadarthe chaturthi yajna ya. आचरत कर्म आचरत कर्म समग्र प्रवीलते प्रवीलते इट इट गेट्स रिजॉल्व नन ऑफ दिस रिमेन्स लया देर इज लया प्रवीलते मीन्स देर इज लया इट इज रिजॉल्व और डिजॉल्व व्हाट इज दैट समग्रम एंटायर एवरीथिंग व्हाट इज दिस एमिग समग्रम अग्र वर्ड इज देयर सम एंड अग्र so bhagwan bhashyakara here i'll show you the bhashya very nice uh, nice vigraha for this so i would like to show that 23rd so 23rd shloka he says sya gata sangasya muktasya he yeah, he puts an evakara here very nice gnane eva avasthitam natu natu anya vishaye anya vishaye or anya yoge also अन्य दर्शने ऑल्सो नो वेर एल्स ओनली इन ज्ञान सो ज्ञाने एव अवस्थित चेतो यस्थित चेता तस्वस्थ चेत सो यज्ञा यज्ञ ओके यज्ञ निवृत्म निवृत्म टू अकम्प्लीश यज्ञ आचरत निर्वर्तयत फॉर अ पर्सन हू इज आचर आचर इज शत्र इज वन हू इज doing the karma so for the person who is doing the karma all are shastis the same person who is a mukta karma samagram samagram very nice vigraha vakya sah agrena so sah bhauri sah agrena vartate iti samagram and what is agra agra is what is going to come ahead agre agra is what phala what will come ahead sah so karma karma along with its result so samagram karma समग्रम इज लाइक एन एडजेक्टिव टू कर्म विच कर्म समग्रम प्रवीलते मीन्स वॉट एवरीथिंग इज रिजॉल्व ऑल कर्म आज आर रिजॉल्व बट नॉट ओनली कर्म अलॉन्ग विथ देर रिजल्ट देर फोर सह अग्रेण इज फलेन अग्रेण इज फलेन वर्तते समग्रम एंड समग्रम कर्म मीन्स कर्म अलॉन्ग विथ इट्स फला प्रवीलते मीन्स विनश्य सो इट इज डिस्ट्रॉय so what is the anvaya here gata sandhasya mukta jnana sthita yajnaya acharata karma samagram praviliyate 
So karma praviliyate, sorry, karma is here two, not one, it is the red jetsu. Karma praviliyate, acharataha, for a person who is achare, who is doing achara. So karma samagra, nothing else to be done, I think this, this sanvaya is okay, as is, we rarely find this, but uh, this sanvaya as is should be okay. Only thing is that samagra, after samagra you can put karma. Yajnayaha karma acharata. Karma can go with acharata also here. I will put it in bracket here. Karma acharata. Samagram pravi, karma praviliyate. Kasmat puna karunat kriyamanam karma sarva karyaram, karyaram bhum akuruvat samagram praviliyate iti ucchate yataha. So he says, Kasmat Puna Karana, due to what reason, Kriyamanam Karma, that karma which is being done, Kriyamanam, Shanajanta, being done. Let us shat, Shatra Shanachau, Shatra Shanachari is in the sense of let. So Kriyamanam means doing, performing, performing this karma, for what reason, Sarva Karyarambham, that Arambha which was talked about here earlier, that is Karyarambha. So, kara, karyarambham akuruvat, kriyamanam karma, sw, sorry not sarvakara, svakarya, svakarambham akuruvat samagram praviliyate. What is akuruvat here? Just give me a moment. Which shloka is this? 24th. I would just cross check something. I don't have the tika. Okay, yeah, so it's an adjective to karma. I was just thinking. Okay, so this karma, which is said samagram karma praviliyate, and <coughs> sorry, samagram is what? That phala. Uh, agrena sa vartate, sa agrena vartate, or sa phalena vartate, iti sapalam, or sagar, samagram. So this uh, karma. Along with its result, it gets destructed. That's what is said. Now, that karma is creating the phala. How can karma, which is being done, kriyamanam karma, swakarya rambham is, it, what is the karya of karma? Phala. So, swakarya arambham akurvat, not doing. So, akurvat, karma akurvat. Karma is, this akurvat is shatranta and nanjat purusha, not Kuruvat means doing, Akuruvat means not doing, not doing, this karma is not doing Svakaryarambha, meaning what? It is not creating its own karya, its result and thereby it gets destroyed along with its karya. How, how is it so? Iti ucchate, why is it that it is not generating its karya and karma is getting destructed without any phala? So that is what yataha, yataha because due to the, what reason that is said in the next shloka. Brahmar panam brahma havihi, brahma agnu brahmana hutam, brahma ivatena gantavyam, brahma karma samadhina. Very common and very famous shloka. In fact, used as bhojana mantra also at many places. Brahma arpanam, brahma arpanam, brahma Havihi, neuter, Havihi is neuter, Havis is the Pratipadika, Brahma Agnav, Samasa, you can split it also, but you, if you split it, you get no meaning, so this is a Samasa, Brahmana Hutam, Brahmana Hutam, Brahma Eva, Tena Gantavyam, Brahma Karma Samadhina, Tritya Ekavachana. 
so here also most of the words are in order very simple words are very simple very complicated shloka why very complicated because how can this be brahma arpanam brahma the brahma is what brahi vriddhau from that dhatu brahi vriddhau this is infinity that brahma which is limitless which cannot be limited by anything because brahi vriddhau here it is not qualified by any visheshana it is a substantive it is that substantive which appears as the entire prapancha and the universe science says is tending to infinity infinite universe there are so many universes now this so parallel universes are there so here this brahma is infinity limitless satchidananda brahma or satyam jnanam anantam brahma that brahma is what arpanam arpanam means in a consider a homa situation a yajna is being done so yajna ya acharatah he is doing yajna now we take the yajna literally what is the literal yajna the homa where he is making an offering nitya agni hotri va whatever homa is doing which is nit, nitya karma really nitya karma nitya nimitti karma natu kamya karma kamya karma he would have given up long back otherwise he wouldn't become a gyani uh, so brahma arpanam arpana means that ladle by which you offer the ghee uh, ityadi brahma havihi what is offered is that ghee ityadi which is offered is called as havihi so what is this homa havi havi tyagah uh, devan uddishya havi tyagah that is this yajna havi tyagah means offering of havihi devan uddishya or devatam uddishya considering as it as an offering making an offering to the lord it is towards the lord it is not to the fire of course there are some ahutis to the fire also but agni he is like a uh, like a postmaster or like a postman who would give the havi to whoever it was offered to so if you offer to indraya indraya swaha it goes to indra he takes it and offers it to in a at a there is a subtle offering so he forwards it to indra so and so on so brahma is arpana brahma itself is havi what is this hutam hutam here is bhave vyutpatti so hutam is that which is the offering itself the kriya the kriya of offering havihi in homa kriya itself that is what brahmana hutam the kriya brahmagna in the agni which is brahma brahmana kartra the kar, the karta is also Brahm, here brahma also means brahmana but here brahmana is what that brahmana or whoever it is maybe a kshatriya also but he is what he is that brahma himself because he is a jnani so as brahma is offering into the agni which is brahma so the adhikarana is brahma here what brahma arpanam is arpana is karana karne vitpatti so karne vitpatti is karana karne lut this is the karaka karana karaka havi is what karma karaka agni is what adhikarana karaka what is brahmana kartra hutam so this is bhave vitpatti so shuddha dhatvartha so we start from the dhatu the karta is here karta brahmana hutam so karmani karmani uh, here it is uh, karmani vitpatti offering but what is being not karmani but here it is bhave as in the act of offering itself as per the, because karma is already here havihi uh, so brahma is what it is the shuddha dhatu artha here it is the karta here it is the karma here it is the karana here and then what else everything every karaka this indicative every karaka is brahma and brahma eva tena gantavyam it is also the goal tena gantavyam brahma eva gantavyam tena tena brahmana tena brahmana brahma eva gantavyam who is this tena 
ब्रह्म कर्म समाधिना ब्रह्मणा ब्रह्म एव गंतव्यम so brahma is also the destination so it is not only the karma which is offered in the homa it is also karma phala rupa karma so it is also brahma eva tena gantavyam he attains brahma how does he attain brahma he is a jnani therefore he attains brahma otherwise sequentially through karma yoga and then one who you know who does not have jnana but he takes the shloka for what it is worth what he understands and does it anyway with this buddhi he does it with a brahma buddhi in arpana in a brahma buddhi with brahma buddhi in havihi in agnihi unto himself in the kriya and in the goal that he attain all that is what he he has samadhi samadhi he has therefore brahma karma samadhi na brahma karma samadhi na samadhi is what samadhi is pullinga unlike in hindi samadhi is trilingi trilingi trilinga shabda samadhi lagi kya sadhu ji so the as samadhi lagi kya so that is trilinga but here lagi is trilinga in hindi here samadhi is ki pratyanta ki pratyanta is uh, is uh, like vidhi uh, vidhi or samadhi uh, that is uh, pullinga ki ki pratyanta so now this pullinga shabda and samadhina brahmana this is pullinga here by a person who is brahma who sees himself as brahma this karta so this is that person so what is it it is bahuri brahma eva karma brahma eva karma all this karma that he is doing that is all brahma for him he has brahma buddhi in everything that he is doing every karma is brahma everything of so basically what he has sarvatma bhava brahma everything is brahma isha isha vasya midam sarvam all this is pervaded by bhagwan who is brahma nirguna brahma who with his maya shakti has become saguna brahma and he has become the karana for this prapancha he has manifested himself as this as this prapancha that is the buddhi of this person therefore yatra yatra mano gachyati tatra tatra samadhaya wherever the mind goes that's where brahma is he does not have to Uh, to start with maybe but he does not have to uh, do dharana dhyana samadhi he does not have to follow the yogic process for samadhi because he has a jnana process for samadhi now everywhere there is brahma so he does not have to withdraw the mind from anywhere and say i will focus on tattvamasi vakya and I'll, i'll attain samadhi all this he has already done because he has jnana he has jnana he knows aham brahmasmi and then uh, he is just continuing this because he cannot take sanyasa which is what has been said earlier now brahma eva tena gantavyam so after vidhe mukti he will attain brahma completely now he is jivan mukta hai and has attained brahma so one who has already is already free will be freed after the drop of the body because he will not be having the upadhi limitation also he will merge with ishwara as do because his sharira will merge with maya with the uh, with the unmanifest so totally he will merge not only in in cognitive cognition he knows that i am i was never separate but he will also merge he because his body will resolve into its karana after the vidhe mukti so brahma eva tena gantavyam and what is this brahma brahma all this karma is brahma for him everything is brahma therefore karma brahma eva karma yasya that brahma eva karma so, sorry not yasya he yasya is sama brahma eva karma and tasmin brahma karmani tasmin brahmani which is now karmani also so brahma karma is karma dharya brahma karmani eva samadhi yasya so brahma karma brahma karmani brahma karma eva samadhi yasya so we will say 7 7 in one single vakya we will say brahma karma is brahmani karmani brahma karmani samadhi either you do karma dharya if it is easy and say karma dharya and then say brahma karma one word brahma karma brahma karmani samadhi yasya or you say what you say brahma karmani 
samadhi yes but this can be confusing as what uh, seven seven it may be confusing for some but i'll write both brahma karmani samadhi yasya so this seven here is for both of these both this brahma and karma which are in samanadi karana therefore seven 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 here means it's it's uh, saptami both are saptami means they are in samanadi karana so they are karma dharya so if you want to split into karma dharya and bahuri you can do that otherwise aneka manya padarthe thereby bahuri in bahuri aneka manya padarthe you can take one single, single vigra vakya as a brahmani karmani or brahma karmani samadhi yasya sah brahma karma samadhi and then tena tena तेन ब्रह्मकर्म समाधिना ब्रह्मणा ऑल दिस तेन गंतव्यम सो ब्रह्म अर्पणम ब्रह्म हवि ब्रह्म अग्नो ब्रह्मणाहुतम ब्रह्म एव तेन गंतव्यम तेन ब्रह्मकर्म समाधिना गंतव्यम सो जस्ट वन चेंज इन टू मेक अन्वय सो हियर सम पीपल से दैट इट इज it is a prescription of uh, of uh, like uh, in a, in uh, in shivalinga you have shiva buddhi or you in uh, in something else you have in pratima you have vishnu buddhi or some other buddhi similarly in in saligrama in saligrama you have vishnu buddhi like that in arpana you should have brahma buddhi in havihi you should have brahma buddhi in agnihi brahmagni you have to have so brahmagni itself means uh, brahmeva agni here also brahmeva agni this is karma dharya brahmeva agni not bahuri this is karma dharya and then or uh, you can make madhyapada lopa also uh, brahma roopa agni that kind of a, is also possible let's give it karma dharya there is no roopa there but roopa is in swarupa brahmana hutam brahma eva tena gantavya so this is that all this there you have to have that brahma buddhi it is not brahma so uh, aropa on advaita is that it is not teaching that everything is brahma it is saying that for some greater phala bhagwan krishna is saying you have brahma buddhi in it does not make it so you invoke vishnu into it as though when you are doing saligrama puja you say this is vishnu this is vishnu so thereby what will happen then you will get more phala you will get vishnu loka ityadi all this is is refuted here by saying that there is nothing he in fact i'll just show you some part of bhashya uh, long bhashya so here he yatra kechid ahuhu some people say what yat brahma tad arpana आदिनी ब्रह्मेव किल अर्पणादीन पंच विधेन एक्सेट्रा अर्पणा बुद्धि निर्वर्त है कि यथा प्रतिमाद विष्णु आदि बुद्धि जस्ट लाइक इन एनी आइडल और एनी सालग्राम इत्यादि विष्णु आदि बुद्धि इन सालग्राम इन शिवलिंग यू से शिवलिंग इज शिव शिवलिंग इज नॉट सम स्टोन सिमिलरली सालग्राम इज नॉट सम स्टोन इट इज विष्णु हिमसेल therefore that buddhi is what that is buddhi your buddhi you superimpose something on it and then you do puja as though you are offering to the lord so that's why you do meditation you you invoke the lord and then you uh, do all the all the vishesha whatever you have offerings you have made you offer it to him all puja all chanting every deepa uh, dhupa deepa nividya ityadi all that you offer to the stone not to the stone for the onlooker who has no culture he will say it is being done to the idol nobody does it to the idol it is a sentient being there so vishnu buddhi is there because you invoke the lord there and this is your buddhi now in your vision there is vishnu there there is shiva there yatha va nama do brahma buddhi riti or in some nama you invoke brahma similarly he says this is what it means kat kechid ahu some say that this is how it is and there those such people are, are there now also who have come up even after refutation and then they object to advaita satyam bhagwan vashagara is satyam it is possible evo api syat it would have been possible 
यदि हैड इट ज्ञान यज्ञ सुक्तर्थम प्रकरणम न स्यात हैड दिस नॉट बीन द सेक्शन वेयर देयर इज ज्ञान स्तुति दिस ब्रह्म ब्रह्मार्पणम इत्यादि इज ज्ञान स्तुति इफ अ ज्ञानी व्हाट अ ज्ञानी डज यू आल्सो डू इट इज अ स्तुति ऑफ ज्ञान ज्ञान व्हाट काइंड ऑफ ज्ञान अमंग ऑल द यज्ञास ज्ञान यज्ञ इज प्रेज we'll see this further so he says that shreyan dravya maya yajnat jnana yajnah vishishyate or something he said in 33rd shloka so if you look at the 33rd shloka here at the end of this section which is beginning here what is being done all the yajnas are quoted and then shreyan dravya dravya maya yajnat jnana yajnah parantapa sarvam karma karma khilam partha jnane parisamapyate so this is this is stuti of jnana yajna brahmarpanam ityadi shlokena whatever samyak darshana is taught by uh, this shloka till this 32 so here you look at this there are bahuvida yajna which will come up now we'll go through them quickly because anvaya is simple i'll leave the anvaya to you so it starts here brahmarpanam brahmavi brahmagnu brahmano so this is a section of yajna among all the yajnas this is one yajna which is praise jnana yajna this is called as jnana yajna because even when you are doing the yajna you are, you are doing it with jnana that everything everything is brahma sarvam brahma is sarvam khalu brahma sarvam khalu idam brahma so that is the praise here jnanam stauti uh, otherwise it would have been possible he takes the purva paksha he comes down the purva paksha by saying satyam you you would have been right had this not been the section of jnana stuti not only that and then he says anyatha sarvasya brahmatve arpanadina me visheshata brahmatva vidhanam anarthakam syat look at everything you know samartham idam vachanam brahmarpanam ityaj jnanasya yajnatva sampadane why it is being said that this is brahma this is brahma all this would be meaningless otherwise if there is a meditation to be done and then jnanam stuti has said jnanam stuti jnana is being praised and not only that he says nacha drishti sampadana jnanena moksha phalam prapyate just by meditating about something by some superimposition those ideas are not going to lead to moksha phala which has been said moksha phala i will get and then uh, See, Brahma, Brahma, ye vati na ganta vim has been said. So, moksha phala is not possible by some kind of a thing that you are saying with this upasana. Uh, by this Brahma buddhi, in that you will attain moksha. That will not be uh, possible because Brahma vidya is being taught here. Then, prakruta virodhascha. It is opposed to context also because suddenly this nyana, nyana context of nyana is going on, and suddenly. samyak darshanam is prakrutam karmanya karma yah pashyet has just gone by two shlokas back we have said karmanya karma yah pashyet one who sees this this is what jnana we have established that it is not something else it is not we have refuted all the purva bhakshan we have established that this is jnana seeing karma in akarma and akarma in karma we have seen we have spent some time there this is jnana ityatra suddenly अंतेज सम्यक दर्शन एवरीथिंग इज ओनली ज्ञान एंड सडनली इन द बिगिनिंग देर इज ज्ञान उपसंहार कंक्लूजन इज ऑल्सो ज्ञान इन दिस कॉन्टेक्स्ट ऑफ द चैप्टर ऑल्सो एंड सडनली सडनली वॉट ही सेज यू अप्रकरण त्र अकस्मा सडनली अर्पणाद ब्रह्मदृष्टि अप्रकरण प्रति प्रतिमायां इव विष्णु दृष्टि उच्यते इति उपप अनुपपन्नम इट इज अनटेनेबल दैट सडनली आउट ऑफ नो वेयर नाउ ही इज टीचिंग उपासना ब्रह्मदृष्टि ऑल दिस ब्रह्मार्पणम इत्यादि ना अप्रकरण आउट ऑफ कॉन्टेक्स्ट प्रति प्रतिमायां इव विष्णु दृष्टि जस्ट लाइक यू हैव अ विष्णु दृष्टि इन एन आइडल यू हैव ब्रह्मदृष्टि इन द लेडल और इन अग्नि or in yourself also all this is out of context therefore what tasmat yatha vyakhyartha eva ayam shloka the way we have taught that is how it is it is jnana and it is a jnana stuti also which we will see in the further shlokas 
So with that in background, let's go through the other shokas in a little more speed than usual, unless not needed. Tatra aduna samyak darshanasya yajnyatam sampadhyaya tas tutyartham anyapi yajnya upakshipyante. Having taught this aduna samyak darshanasya yajnyatam, this samyak darshana itself is a yajnya. Seeing everything, this is all uh, in the context of yajnya, but need not be so. It is ev seeing everything, uh, sarvatma bhava, seeing yourself, Brahma is you, seeing yourself everywhere, or at least to start with seeing everything as Ishwara, that itself is yajna. So, tat tatra adhuna in this, in this shloka now, samyak darshana si yajnyatvam, the samyak darshana jnana itself is yajna, therefore you see jnana yajna, you have many places jnana yajna, jnana yajna going on. Sampadhyaya tat sutyartham for its praise, anya api yajna upakshipyante. These are all these yajnas are thrown in form of shlokas by Bhagavan Krishna because he wants to say all these are yajnas. Among these yajnas, Brahma yajna is the best this reshta. That is istuti. What are these other yajnas? Daiva meva pare yajnam yoginah paryupasate Brahma gnava pare yajnay yajnay naiva upayuhati So daivam eva apare. Daivam. So deva sambandhi daivam. Eva apare yajnyam yoginaha pariyupasate. All these are first case. Yogina is shashti ekvachana. Uh, not shashti na, sorry. Uh, uh, yoginaha pariyupasate. So pariyupasate is plural. Yogina. Okay, let me write this. It is prathama yoginaha pariyupasate. Pariyupasate is plural. So yogis do they worship, worship whom? Daivam, Daivam Eva, Daivam Eva Apare, Apare, Daivam Yajnyam, Daivam Yajnyam Yoginaha Pariyupasate. So you can put together karmas, Daivam Yajnyam, Yoginaha Daivam Yajnyam Eva Pariyupasate. And what is this? Next one is in contrast, Brahmagnu apare, not avapare, apare, apare, yajnyam, yajnena eva upajuhati. So this, this sloka will see the meaning. It is a little complicated in terms of meaning. Apare upajuhati. So this is also yajna. So yogis do yajna. Who are these? Karma yogis. We have seen in the second chapter and third chapter. Yogis are karma yogis here. And who are these? Uh, apare. Apare. Yajnena yajnam eva upajuhati. They also make the offering unto the yajna. They are also following yajna. So on, on one hand, yogis are doing yajna. On other hand, these others are doing yajna. Who are these? Apare. These are jnanis. So, karma yogis and jnana yogis. So, karma yogis do daiva yajna. Daiva yajna. And in Brahmagni, others offer yajnam yajnena eva upajuhati. Here, yajna has a very peculiar derivation. In Brahmagni, Yajna is Atma. They are offering Atma, oneself. So, why oneself offering? Because there is no individuality. This Yajna is individuality, which is Jivatma. That individuality of Jivatma is called as Yajna here. Yajnena, by oneself, one offers oneself unto Brahma, meaning merges with Brahma. That is what a Jnani does. Jnani merges with Brahma, this is figurative. You offer yourself unto Brahma because you offer your individuality unto the total, there is no individuality left. There is one homogeneous entity. So this is Yajna. Bhagavan Bhashyakara explains this. He says, Daivam Deva Ijyanti Yena Yajnena Asau Daivaha Yajnaha. So Tameva Apare Yajnam Yoginaha Karminaha Pariyupasate Kurvanti Karminaha. Karminaha Karma Yoginaha. Both are possible. They uh, 
they propitiate the lords different types of they they offer yajyante yena yajnena aso de daivah yajna this is yajna so yajna uh, karminah pari upasate paritah upasate kurvanti ityartha they they perform yajna brahmagnu satyam jnanam anandam brahma that is brahma here and that is agni vijnanam anandam brahma yat sakshat purushat brahma yatma sarvantara ityadi vachana uktam ashnayadi sarva samsara dharma varjitam neti neti iti nirastha ashesh vishesham brahma shabdena uchyati what is brahma all these are telling you nirguna brahma i am not going to details uh, so brahma shabdena uchyati that is nirguna brahma and brahmagnu brahma chat tat agnischa karma dharaya brahma itself is agni सह होमादि कर्णत्व विवक्षया ब्रह्माग्नि ही टेकिंग होमा बिकॉज यज्ञ इज व्हाट होमा टेकिंग दैट सिमिली ऑफ यज्ञ एज होमा वेयर अग्नि इज यूज देयर ड्यू टू दैट सिमिली ब्रह्मा इज कॉल्ड एज अग्नि एंड इन दैट अग्नि ही एज होमा इन ब्रह्मा निर्गुण ब्रह्मा तस्मिन ब्रह्माग्नु निर्गुण ब्रह्म ब्रह्मणी इत्यर्थ अपरे अन्य ब्रह्मविद दो ज्ञानी यज्ञम दे ऑफर यज्ञ व्हाट इज यज्ञ यज्ञ शब्द वाच्य आत्मा आत्मा इज जीवात्मा हियर इंडिविजुअल आत्मा नाम सु यज्ञ शब्द से पाठा बिकॉज समवेयर इन द पाठा यज्ञ शब्द हैज बीन यूज्ड फॉर आत्मा तम आत्मानम यज्ञम परमार्थतः परमेव ब्रह्म संतम बुद्ध्याद्युपादि संयुक्तम अध्यस्त सर्वोपाद धर्मकम आहुति रूपम यज्ञने एव आत्मना एव उक्त लक्षणेन उपजुवति प्रक्षिपन्ति सो दे ऑफर this individual unto the total that is the meaning here sopadikasya atmana nirupadikena parabrahma swarupena eva yad darshanam sa tasmin homaha what is this basically offering yourself unto uh, brahma is what basically sopadikasya atmana the atma which has an upadhi which i have an upadhi of this sharira Uh, the body mind sense complex but without the body mind sense complex is the laksharta of the jiva shabda that nirupadikena parabrahma swarupena eva darshanam seeing oneself as without the upadi without being limited by the all the uh, shariras the stool and sukshma sharira or karana sharira seeing that and thereby what is left is from tam pada vachyartha one has gone to lakshartha that itself is offering unto brahma there is no real offering this is figurative so yad darshanam yad, that vision sah tasmin homa tam kurvanti brahmatmaikatva darshina darshana nishtaha sanyasina ityartha those sanyasis who have given up everything except for the nishta in atma darshana as atma being one with brahma that itself is called as homa here as offering brahma yajna yajna being atma upajuhati offer so pari upa and offering is what this is darshana atma darshana so on one hand the grahastha or the other ashramis and on the other hand the uh, sanyasis this is what is said so otherwise on another way is karma yogis or karminah and then uh, this other half second half is talking about jnana yajna which is the uh, brahma dar, uh, atma darshana आत्मदर्शन और ब्रह्मात्म दर्शन ब्रह्मेव आत्म दैट कैंड ऑफ दर्शन दैवे दैव यज्ञ दैवे योगिन दैव यज्ञ पुपासते and brahmagnu uh, apare apare yajnam yajnena eva upajuhati apare we can say this is jnaninah or brahma vidah so this is the other part here soyam samyak darshan lakshana yajna daiva yajna dishu yajneshu upakshipyate brahmarpanam ityadi shlokaihi prastutah shreyan dravyamaya yajnad jnana yajnah parantapa 
इत्यादिना सुत्यर्थम सो दिस सम्यक दर्शन लक्षण यज्ञ व्हाट एवर वी हैज बीन टॉक्ड अबाउट दैट ज्ञान ज्ञान यज्ञ इज थ्रोन इन टू अदर अदर सॉर्ट्स ऑफ यज्ञस फ्रॉम दिस श्लोका ब्रह्मार्पण ऑनवर्ड्स टिल श्रेयान द्रव्य मयाद व्हाट वी सो है 33rd श्लोका सो एंटायर सेट इज सेट ऑफ यज्ञस आर शोन हियर एंड to praise the jnana yajna which is samyak darshan lakshana yajna shrotra dhin indriyan yanye sanyam agni shu juhati shabda dhin vishyan yanye indriya agni shu juhati so since we broke the pada we break the sandhi shrotra dhin indriyani anye sanyam agni shu juhati so anye anye juhati juhati is plural ज्योत्यादिगण संयम आग्निषु इंद्रियाणी सो दिस बिकम्स कर्म शब्दादीन विषयान शब्दादीन विषयान अन्य इंद्रियाग्निषु जूहति सो बेर मिनिमम व्हाट यू नीड फॉर यज्ञ इज अग्नि एंड कर्ता ऑफ Of course, a karta is assumed. You need somebody to offer something to offer unto, and something to offer. Bare minimum need is adhikarana, karma, and karta. Now, karta who are who are the karta? Anye. Some here also anye. So there are two sets of people now being talked about who perform two types of yajnas. What are these? First set of people offer shrotra dini indriyani anye. अन्य श्रोत्रादि इंद्रिया ऑल दी इंद्रिया सचेत दी सेंस ऑर्गन ऑफ हियरिंग इत्यादि ऑल दी इंद्रिया दे ऑफर इन संयम आग्नि संयम आग्निषु अन्य संयम आग्निषु दिस इज अधिकरण विच इज होम आग्नि इन दैट दे ऑफर व्हाट इज इंद्रिया दे ऑफर देयर सेंस ऑर्गन ऑल दी सेंस ऑर्गन इन दी इन दी अग्नि ऑफ कंट्रोल सेल्फ कंट्रोल बर्न्स इट बर्न्स A person has so much of karma to control that it burns. So therefore, that in that sanyama, you offer and then you yourself burn. You burn your karma through the indriya. You offer the indriyas unto them, and you don't do bhoga. So thereby, you offer unto the fire of control. That is what is being said. So shamadama, they practice shamadama. This is the meaning. This practice of shamadama itself is. is yajna what about the others others cannot do that so some of them they cannot do that they have to indulge so what they do they indulge restrain they try to restrain but they indulge but even during the indulgence whether they knowingly or unknowingly preferably knowingly they perform it as yajna they say that this indriyas are are the lord and i am offering unto them i am offering the vishayas so specific vishayas to specific indriyas they offer even when they are are consuming uh, through the sense organs they offer all the vishayas unto the indriya so indriyas are the agni for the sadaka sanyam agni and for the uh, for so for the yogi for the sadaka means yogi he offers unto sanyam agni he offers indriyas themselves unto sanyam agni agni he does not offer vishayas but for a bhogi he offers offers the shabdadin vishayan all the vishayas of of the shrotradi indriyas unto the shrotradi indriyas this is the yajna so anye indriya agnishu shrotradi indriya agnishu shabdadin vishayan juhati so this is another type of yajna किंच सर्वाणी इंद्रिय कर्माणी प्राण कर्माणी चापरे आत्म संयम योगाग्नो जूहति ज्ञान दीपिते अदर्स व्हाट दे डू अपरे अपरे अन्य सेम मीनिंग अदर्स सम अदर्स सम अदर्स व्हाट दे ऑफर सो इट्स नॉट हियर सॉरी हियर अपरे अपरे च अपरे च व्हाट डू दे ऑफर सर्वाणी इंद्रियाणी सर्वाणी इंद्रिय कर्माणी नॉट इंद्रिया इंद्रिय कर्माणी ऑल दी कर्मज ऑफ द इंद्रिया एंड दी प्राण कर्म दे ऑफर सो 
here these offer the indriyas, here they offer the vishayas, here the karma itself, the kriya, the indriya karma and prana karma, all the prana karma also put together they offer, not aparicha, you can take uh, sarvani, indriya karmani, prana karmani cha. What do they do? Atma sanyama, atma sanyama yoga agnu, in the yoga agni. At, or which is of the form of Atma Sanyama. Here Sanyama is concentration. So Atmani Sanyama. De, Sanyama also has a yogic connotation where Dharana, Dhyana, Samadhi put together is called as Sanyama. That is done for Siddhis, generally for Siddhis. Or here you can take as uh, the Vedantic method of Atmani Sanyama. Sanyama is concentration on Atma, focus on Atma. That itself becomes Yoga Agni. Yoga and that Atma Sanyama Yoga Nididhyasana Rupa in that Agni or Nididhyasana Rupa this can be meditation rather. Meditation is uh, like Ahangra Upasana. I am, I am Bhagawan. One does not understand it but then he, because this cannot be Jnana. Jnana has gone by. Jnana Stuti is being done. What is this? This is one who does not understand, whose buddhi is not tevra, it is not sharp. He has so many questions, so many doubts but he has Shraddha in the Shastra. And the Guru, then he says that, okay, let me meditate upon it. Guru says that if you do not understand, do Ahangra Upasana, think yourself as Brahma. So that Atma Sanyama Yoga Agnu, Sarvani Indriya Karmani, Prana Karmani Cha Juhati. These are second case, second cases. And then, Apare you already know. So Sarvani, this is second case. So Prana Karmani Cha Juhati, they offer. And what is that, that Atma Sanyama Yoga uh, Sanyama Yoga Agnu, he is doing Shravana, therefore Jnana Deepite, which is lit up by the knowledge. It is lit up by the knowledge and unto that Atma Sanyama Yoga Agnu, he is practicing that. He is not a Jnani yet. He is not an Aparoksha Jnani yet. Paroksha Jnani may be. So he is still practicing or he is doing Ahangra Upasana and thereby Jnana, but that is lit up by jnana, knowledge that I am Brahma. He does not understand it clearly, but he has Shraddha in Shastra and Guru and thereby follows that and thereby all karma, Indriya karma and Prana karma, he offers unto that. He says, all that is happening in my body is all, all being offered all to Bhagavan. It is due to Brahma and he understands a little, thereby he has his own methodology of doing this Yajna. This is one type. What about the next one? Dravya Yajnastapo Yajna Yuga Yajnastathapare Swadhyaya Yajnana Yajnascha Yataya Samshita Prataha So there are some sannyasis or those who have Yataya So Yatis Who are Samshita Prataha Samshita Prataha they have They have lot of Vratas They follow lot of disciplines And they have their own Vratas to follow as Yatis Orthodox Sampradaya has lot of things that a Yati should do they follow all that. Swadhyaya Jnana Yajna Ascha. Swadhyaya is there. Jnana Yajna. Jnana Yajna is uh, what we saw. And then other Jnana Yajna is also there. And Swadhyaya is there means Svena Adhyaya, Svasya Adhyaya Va. Both are possible. Doing on oneself, by oneself one studies. And also Svasya Adhyaya, he studies oneself. Dravya Yajna, there are some who are, so all these are what? They are not the same people. They need not be the same people. So, Dravya Yajna, huh? Dravya Yajna means they, Dravya, they use Dravya and do Yajna. Tapo Yajna, Tapa is a Yajna. So, Dravya Yajna is what Bhagavan Bhashyakara says, Dravya Parityagaha. They take all the material and then give it, they dana. So, this is, Dravya Yajna is dana in Tirtha Kshetra Ityadi. So, that is Dravya Yajna. Dravya, that is Dravya, not that is Dravya Yajna and Dravya Yajna, Yajna Yeshamte, those who have, so Apare, this is in Samana Dikran with Apare, so those who are Dravya Yajna, meaning giving Dravya is their Yajna, doing Dana is their Yajna, thereby it becomes Karma Yoga, Tapo Yajna, Tapaha is Yajna, so Tapo Yajna Yeshamte, those who have Tapa, Tapasa is Yajna, so they are Tapo Yajna, Yoga Yajna, Yoga, they follow Ashtanga Yoga. All this is being done for Mukti itself. Therefore, they follow all this. But by itself, it does not give Mukti. 
देर फोर दाना डज नॉट दाना इनडायरेक्टली लीड्स टू मुक्ति बाय वाय कर्म कर्म कर्मयोग चित्त शुद्धि एंड देन ज्ञान श्रवण मन विद्यासन सो ऑल दीज आर इनडायरेक्ट मीन्स तपस ऑल्सो डज नॉट डायरेक्टली लीड टू मुक्ति इनडायरेक्टली यस योग ऑल्सो इनडायरेक्टली यस चित्त शुद्धि द्वारा तथा अपरे स्वाध्याय ज्ञान यज्ञ एंड यतय संशित व्रता सो स्वाध्याय ज्ञान यू कैन टेक इट सम यू कैन टेक टुगेदर सम कैन बी सेपरेट सो स्वाध्याय ज्ञान यज्ञ स्वाध्याय स्टडी बाय वन सेल्फ एज वेल एज श्रवण इत्यादि इज यज्ञ फॉर दम दैट इट सेल्फ इज यज्ञ दे नीड नॉट डू एनीथिंग इफ दे हैव चित्त शुद्धि सो दैट बिकम्स यज्ञ देन यतीज आर दो संशित व्रता दे हैव very difficult vratas to follow so all that is so yat is also that is yajna so there is nothing much to do just reorder as tatha apare here tatha apare very simple all are in first case except for avyaya here and avyaya here all everything everything else is first case okay we'll stop here we have crossed over then skincha so kincha others also now some pranayama etc will be discussed as yajna then some uh, control of ahara ityadi as yajna and then uh, those who eat the offering of the uh, yajna as or whatever is offered unto the lord they partake of that that is a, a, another yajna and there are so many different yajna these are all upalakshana and then jnana yajna will be praised so we we'll stop here we'll continue in the next part of Shanti, shanti, shanti. Any questions? something slowed down no questions okay i'll see you in the next part then i okay namaste